knocking. What's going on, guys? Come on in. Move. Welcome back. <laughs> it's actually pretty fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm not frosted at these chairs, but I sound like I see it. Alright, look. Nike Dunk Investment. What are we doing today? Today and for two hours. What are you doing? I'm trying to film it. My son is filming a video. I need to show them the I need to show them the table. You might be wondering, how do you close the cables in your desk? Well you see it's just intuitive. That's how you close it. And now we gotta move it. Look at that. He literally didn't put this. Like, how am I supposed to wait, I think I got it. Halfway there. Dude, just look out this. No, no, I already, I already almost got it. Yes, I think this is how you do it. There we go. Box number. Stop! Matter of fact, <laughs> you gotta stop. I'm drinking over here like some tea, but uh, there you go. We're gonna do a quick count. We're gonna do a, we're gonna do a quick count. All the shoes, make sure I got all the sizes. I think it's 198 pairs. Because every single time I get bulk, I don't count it. And then, um, <laughs> I lose pairs. What? <laughs> it looks like a dick. <laughs> Dude, stop, kids watch this, it's not funny. Wow, Krasavitz. Krasavitz, mother sapyak maninki. They don't know who we are. Speak some Russian. Tell them some some words I've taught you. Some words I've taught you. Yeah. Stop. 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 All right. So why did I invest in these? I'm sorry. There's noise behind us, but um, I'm still gonna do it because. The dunks. Matter of fact, I actually have a personal pair. We can get rid of those. I used a personal pair right here. Might as well wear them because if I'm investing into them um, and putting and putting damn near sixty thousand dollars or however much it was into some shoes, I feel like I should probably get a pair myself. Just because, like, it doesn't really make sense, but. This was a shoe I predicted that would rise in value about three or so months ago. They were $200. I put it in my chat right here. I said that these are gonna go from 200 to 300 ish. That's what they did. Me being the idiot that I am, I didn't buy in at 200. I waited and I waited and I waited and they went up to about 280 to 300. And I was like, more people are starting to wear dunks all of my dunk investments have been profitable. I had one failed dunk investment right here, but I ended up selling those for a profit because I still held them. All dunks are pretty much going up. Um, and that's what I'm gonna talk a lot about in this talk on dunks that you know you could buy. A lot of dunks with a white and then a color right here, color blocking type scheme, those typically go up a lot in value. And we look at the Syracuse Dunk, we look at the Kentucky Dunk, we look at the St. John Dunk Low. So many dunks, they've went up and I just thought to myself like, am I gonna miss this opportunity of the dunk wave? Absolutely not. Are you guys, it's up to you, um, but I really don't want this investment to be a, you guys see me buy 
almost $60,000 worth of dunks. And then you guys quickly, you know, buy as many pairs as you, you know, think you should. I don't think that's how it should go. Matter of fact, I don't want you guys to buy any pairs either because um, that's a trend I've been seeing. A lot of people, they just buy what I buy. They don't actually, you know, put any thought into it. I want you guys to also keep in mind, you know, people who are newer in the game, they could have a bigger risk factor. But I mean, I think these are probably gonna go from 280 from what I bought them at to easily 400 to 500. But like I said, another risk is that they could keep restocking, which is a pretty big risk if you ask me. I mean, they keep restocking and then market goes down, market goes up, market goes down, market goes up. And so that's something you really want to be careful with, with restocks. But like I said, this color scheme does exponentially well, like the white and then a different color right here, white, different color, white, different color. So that does very, very well. I will say that um, another, you know, investment that I will be buying into I think these are the ones you guys should be buying into, not necessarily these. The UNC Dunk, UNC Dunk Low, I believe they're coming out soon. Then there's like the Sand, they're like women's. I think they're like 200 to 250 right now. So definitely buy into those. Um, feel free to buy into these if you want to, but I mean, I personally, unless you like maybe buy a couple at 280, like I said, they went from 200 to 280. So if I would have bought 220 pairs at, what is it? 200, I'd be up, you know, $80 a pair times 220. That's like 17,000. So I'd be up quite a bit, but you know, you live and you learn. It's a long game, not a short game. A lot of people I feel like go into holds, assuming it's gonna be a short, you know, quick profit. They see the profits I've made, you know, the ones that went up really fast and they're like, yeah, I'm gonna jump in. They're gonna go to the moon and then we're gonna make money. It doesn't work like that. Nothing in life is quick. I had no patience when I was younger and, you know, knowing how the real world actually works rather than just, you know, I got lucky and figured out how to invest in the shoes for the most part, I would say, like, and make profit off of that. You know, I think, I think it's really great, you know, where, how that happened. And I'm telling you guys this only because I know I have a really, I have a lot of, you know, young people watching my videos. I. Thank you so much, first of all, for watching my videos and uh, seeing how I do my investments. I don't, I know I don't post that much, but it means a lot to me because when I was 13, 14, I think about this sometimes, like my younger self, who was I watching on YouTube? And the only thing that comes back to me is like, I would watch prank channels and stuff like that. And the way I would buy and sell is through Facebook and eBay. There was no StockX, there was no GOAT. There was really not many people doing holds either. And so being in the game for damn near seven years now. Um, I'm 20 now. I, I, I look a bit older, I feel like, than 20. <laughs> Being in the game for so long, um, I think it, it changed a lot. It definitely changed a lot. And I think that seeing the young kids be able to flourish so much quicker than how I, you know, seven years, that's a long time. I see kids in one year, two years doing a lot more than what I'm even doing now. So it's it's amazing to see, and I'm really happy to see where, you know, the reselling community is going. If you dislike resellers and you're watching this, I'm sorry, maybe you can join the team as well and have fun because it's really a great thing to do. I know this is less of like a investment talk, but I've never really sat down and just like, I guess talk like this, but like I was saying, kind of go back if I was younger and you know, I, I would be able to watch videos like this. I think it would help me tremendously. That's why I do these videos today. Uh, a lot of, if you, I don't know if a lot of you guys know this or don't know this, but I don't get paid from YouTube. And so everything I put out, which I don't post that much too. So, I mean, they shouldn't be paying me honestly, but it's a lot of the copyright stuff. Like I was saying, I don't really get paid from YouTube. So I really just do YouTube just to like show you guys how you can make money. Just something you can do. That's why I don't post that often because I don't need to oversaturate my YouTube and post a hundred videos because that's how I'm going to make my income. Like people post like every day because, and I understand because you know, that's their income, YouTube revenue, but I don't get YouTube revenue. So. Uh, I post when I think something is valuable to you guys and something that's really gonna help you guys. So kind of that, that might explain why I don't post so much. But yeah, to kind of, I guess, give you the full breakdown, don't buy these if I were you, because look at this video more as entertainment. 
but buy the other dunks that are going to be coming out soon. Um, UNC's, the Sands, the Green. I forgot what they're all called. I really don't keep up with sneaker names, but it's just intuitive. I just kind of know. But uh, like I said, buy the other ones, not these. These are a bit late. I do think these are 100% still going to go up, but let me take the risk. If I lose money, look at me and laugh at me. Look at me as like the guy who like lost money. Don't lose money yourself because I'll take the L, but I don't want you guys to take the L. With that being said, yeah, I mean, there you go. That, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Take it how you want. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys for the next video. Peace.